Uh, that was once built to keep kids off the video screen now has a brand new purpose. It's specifically targeting kids with autism. Dan Roscoe takes us inside the story of Benny. And Dan, what makes <laughs> Benny so unique to kids with autism? Well, Mark and Shauna, Benny the Robot is all about teaching communication and social skills, something kids with autism are struggling to learn. But now there could be some new help on the horizon. Oh, there's a pepperoni for your pizza. A special kind of preschool. Should we eat it now? On the campus at UVU. All these young children are battling autism. Three, four. The school is part of the education program at the new Melissa Nellison Center for Autism. The very place... We're still testing this. These BYU students are eager to visit. They've brought something they believe can be a great benefit for the kids. I am so happy. They call him... Benny. I love talking. A robot built exclusively for kids with autism. The main thing that it does is that the child takes care of it. Jared Workman, an engineering and computer science student, is the inventor. He's teamed up with several other BYU students to get Benny up and running. This is prototype number 13, originally built to get kids off the computer screen. It really, it was the parents who helped us decide that it should be for autism. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is white. Benny is now being tested in homes. My name is Benny the Jet Rodriguez. With families like the Steeds. Who's your best friend? My best friend is you. Whose eight-year-old son David has autism. He asks me questions like, how was your day? And then I talk to him about it. What's your favorite food? I love watermelons. The Steeds are one of five families who are testing Benny. Benny teaches me things. The objective is to interact with the child and build social skills. The potential that it has there to help teach things that can be difficult for kids with autism, like emotions and interacting and carrying on a conversation. One way Benny teaches kids about emotions is facial expressions. I'm bored because no one is playing with me. So if the robot is sad, then they'll have to make him feel better. They'll have to start talking to him. They'll have to play games with him. We want Benny to be the first of many friends for these children. The road to mass production into homes is still a ways out. I love you, KU TV. But the Benny team believes. Yes, I'm so excited. It could be a game changer in helping kids with autism. It's, it's kind of an exciting thing to think that this could be you know, a stepping stone to them making friends or a stepping stone to them learning communication skills. I love you, Dan Rasconi. <laughs> <laughs> Dan Rasconi, hey, there you go. Jared's dream would be to one day mass produce Benny and get the price down to about $250. But first, they hope to place another 35 robots into homes for beta testing. For more on that story, go to our website, KUTV.com, click on Features and Inside the Story.